Thomas Weather. The Rich Thomas Weather Network, brought to you by these fine sponsors. Hear Rich's forecast hourly on these Blue Water Broadcasting Radio stations. Hey, good morning, everybody, on this Thursday morning. It's the 21st day of January. My name is Rich. Time as I make this is uh, really early at 3.34 a.m. No rain right now at this location here in East Montgomery, but there is rain on the radar. As you know, rain is likely today tonight and tomorrow carry the rain gear we've been talking about this storm system for a while this is the first of two storm systems in the next five or six days i think we get a little break in the action saturday before the next storm system begins to affect us on sunday and more likely sunday night into monday how much rain are we expecting will any of these be severe and what about what's later what's coming up later in the month we'll take a look at that as well Today, you might say we are in a squeeze play between two frontal systems. Gulf moisture is engulfing the state, and uh, showers will be around from time to time today and tonight and during the day tomorrow. In fact, waves of low pressure will be moving along a stalled front in South Alabama on Friday. And I think by Saturday, uh, the front has gone into the northern Gulf of Mexico, and we get back to drier weather, so the rain will end on Friday night. Rain will be uh, likely at times today and tonight. In fact, some of the heavier rainfall, I think, could be uh, tonight, that is midnight tonight on the uh, on the future radar loop there. So rain is likely at times. High temperature in the lower 60s. We'll say 60 to 62. Tonight, the rain chances are as high as 100%. 54 is the overnight low temperature, and rain continues at times tomorrow. It's not going to rain all the time, but uh, periods of showers will be around, ending Friday night. And the total rainfall could be uh, over an inch in some places, maybe one to two inches in some other areas. By Saturday, with the front down uh, into the northern Gulf of Mexico, we're back to drier weather. I think uh, Saturday's going to be a mild day and the best day of the weekend because showers will return scattered showers on Sunday, especially by Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening, Sunday night. And then by Monday, that's kind of a concerning looking storm system. We don't know if it'll be severe. We think showers and thunderstorms are a good bit Monday. That's a bigger deal storm system as we get into Sunday night and Monday. And by Monday midnight, the front has made it into southeast Alabama. Rain will come to an end in the overnight hours Monday night. And that'll lead to a drier day Tuesday with the front uh, leaving the state of Alabama. So uh, two storm systems in the next five to six days will put the rain chances very high tomorrow with a high temperature up to about 61. Near 60 on Saturday, that's the best day of the weekend. We should be dry. Then scattered showers returning on Sunday, showers and thunderstorms Sunday night into Monday. And again, we'll be watching that storm system. Look at the high on Monday, 76 and lows at night in the 50s and then back to drier weather. We think uh, probably on Tuesday we'll, we'll leave a small 20% chance of rain in on Tuesday. Uh, we're into the uh, we're well into the 70s, I think, on Monday. The Arctic flood gates are closed for the next 10 days. That's good news. The next big deal storm system to me uh, after this, uh, after these next two would be Sunday, uh, probably the last day of the month with showers and thunderstorms taking on a negative tilt. Our weather app will keep you on top of all the weather action. Uh, get it on your phone or tablet now. Instant push notification for severe weather alerts, plus radar and future radar, and 10-day and uh, also hourly forecasts as well. Go to the App Store and search Rich Thomas Weather. And on TV tonight. 2020 is now hindsight, thankfully. And as awful as that year was on so many different levels, this may not surprise you. There were more billion dollar weather disasters in 2020 than in any other year in the 40 years that these records have been kept. A staggering record of $22 billion events, including hurricanes, tropical storms, tornadoes, severe weather, wildfires. We'll talk about it tonight at 6 and 10 on CBS 8 and ABC 32, the Alabama News Network. Join me for my Weather Extra 2020 billion dollar weather disasters. I'm telling you, with everything else that happened in 2020, to have the biggest weather disaster year ever, does that surprise anybody? Uh, I hope you uh, have a chance to watch that on TV tonight. Hey, we're live on the radio this morning from 6 to 9 on News Talk 93.1. That's number one. Number two, we're live on CBS 8 and ABC 32, the Alabama News Network. The morning program is called Alabama Rising. There will be another video first thing tomorrow morning at 4.45 a.m. on Friday morning. And your forecast whenever you want it across the dial on the Blue Water family of stations. Don't forget the rain gear today. You're going to need it. I will see you later. Have a good one.